<sighs> New My Vegas slots update. Okay, well, I know what to do. Let's see if we can exploit the heck out of this. Is the Ace of Vegas, the Ace of Vegas. Hey there, Spinners and Sharks, Ace of Vegas here, and I hope you're doing well. So, per usual, My Vegas has updated their game, updated their app on iOS as well as the Android App Store. And also, per usual, there's another question. Is there a way that we can exploit this new update to get more loyalty points? Well, that's what we're looking to find out today, like we said in the intro. One of the biggest things that we noticed since they did one of their last big updates is that the loyalty points are all on a timer now. Now, this affects all the mobile games, but what we're going to focus on today is the My Vegas Slots app, the original port of the original Facebook game. So that's what we're going to be focusing on today. So what we're going to do for this experiment is we're going to go ahead and see if you can keep spinning and keep getting loyalty points afterwards. And now I know what you're thinking, you're going to be like, hold on Ace, you did a video about this before and it turns out that spinning doesn't affect anything. And that was correct on the Android version of the game. Let me explain. So, in case you guys didn't know, there's two different versions of the game that you can have. Now, the thing is, you can download this game on Android devices and emulators like Bluestacks or your actual Android phone here. Or, alternately, you can download it on iOS devices too, like your iPhone or your iPad. So, with that in mind, what we're going to do is we're going to see if playing on the same account between two different operating systems affects how you get loyalty points. Let's get started. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to max out our loyalty points on an Android device, then after that, we'll be playing our iPhone. And the tool that we're going to be using for this is Bluestacks Emulator. Okay, Spinners and Sharks, what we're going to go ahead and do here is we are starting up and we're going to see exactly how many loyalty points we can start with. So it looks like we're going to be starting with 1,646,178 loyalty points here. So all we need to do is make sure the screen is running and uh, yeah, we're going to be going for a while. Now we're going to be going at this for a little while so I'm just going to go ahead and pick a game and then we'll make sure that it doesn't stop. So we'll just do Luxor Link. I'm going to do the minimum bets on this. Alright, we'll run the auto spin and then here we go. Alright, Spinners and Sharks, so it looks like we're ending on 1,649,878 loyalty points. I think we actually probably started on something like 1,645,000 loyalty points, but I was staring at a couple little bits and pieces, uh, a little bit of the rewards too, so I think while I was doing that, this jumped up a couple hundred loyalty points, but... We'll call it our even 4,000 pointers. We got the green check mark over here. So now our next step is to log out of this and then check on the iPhone. 
All right, spinners and sharks. So no aces up my sleeve over here. Let's go ahead and go. Let's go presto. And you're gonna see that this is the real iPhone whole thing right here. And this is an iPhone 6 with iOS 12.0 on it. So it is compatible with the My Vegas Slots apps. And I'll explain what the iOS requirements are later. But right now, let's go ahead and focus on seeing if we can actually get this done. Okay guys, so looks like we do have the green check mark here. Looks like we are maxed out until the next day, unfortunately. We could try doing one more spin over here, hitting the Luxor. Let's go ahead and give it a go. Three. Two. And last one. Yep, that's it guys. No dice on that one. Our loyalty points didn't jump up a bit. So as you can see from the screen here, we're still sitting at a rather even 1.649878 million loyalty points. That's a million six hundred forty-nine thousand eight hundred and seventy-eight. if you guys didn't catch the decimal. So there's that. Looks like it's about the same there. So it looks like if you do max out on the Android version, you won't be able to keep spinning on the iPhone version, at least not on the My Vegas slots. Now, we might want to consider doing this the other way, and I think I might try it the other way in the morning. So we'll see what happens. All right, looks like we are back to where we were before, 1,649,878 LPs. So, yeah, let's go ahead and hit the Shack 9 real quick, and we'll do some spins here. Figure what we'll go ahead and do is we'll get 1,000 LP. Actually, you know, we gotta shoot for 4,000 LPs, because we know that's the hard limit. So if it shows up as a check after 4,000 LPs, then we know we overdid it. Okay, and then we're going to look for the check mark at 1,653,878 LPs. If we have that at the end of this session over here and it doesn't continue on the Android version of the game, then we know that's how you break it. And if it does, then we know they closed up the loophole and there's not much else to do. Of course, though, we've got some Shack 9 that we got to play through, so we'll go ahead and do that just real quick. See if we can get a good swing. That was a perfect green, too. Come on now. It's par five. I think if I hit a three, we'll be all right. All right, here we go. A little bit of lag on the swing there, but that's fine. That puts us on the green. It's two million. I wonder if there's a code to get the holes in one every time. Always gotta get that hole in one. Alright, do that third swing. That's cool. Alright. Yep, that's an eagle. That's an eagle. Beat the birdie. Alright, alright, alright. We under par. We under par. Alright, let's go ahead. Alright, guys. Final leg of the race here gonna pick up 900 more loyalty points and we'll watch the meter for just a little while longer. No 400 loyalty points and it topped out. Okay so that's our 4,000 daily loyalty points. So now let's go ahead and jump over to the other game and see what happened. Alright Spinners and Sharks and it is confirmed. 1,653,878 loyalty points still and the timer is not counting down so it looks like we are locked out for another 24 hours unfortunately but you know what it was a fun experiment to conduct i guess the real question is which one do you prefer i think i might just enjoy kind of playing through on the iphone more but if i have other things to do i 
think I'll probably just set it to auto spin on a game that doesn't require a lot of interaction, like Rapid Gold Deluxe, for example, since it's the first thing that pops up on the menu over here. Let it run at minimum spins, and then uh, just collect the loyalty points as we go. So, if you're looking for something a little more hands off, I recommend going the Android route. If you're totally fine doing something hands on and something that requires a little bit of attention, hey, you know, go ahead and play on your iPhone or your iPad or what have you. And that's just about that. But yes, my and Sharks, that answers our question regarding whether you can bypass the loyalty point limit by switching operating systems. And the final answer is no, you cannot, at least not with the My Vegas Slots mobile app. All right, there's Spanish and Sharks. That's it for today's video. If you enjoyed today's episode and found it informative, I'd appreciate a like and consider subscribing if you haven't already. Shout outs to everybody that requested this My Vegas experiment, and actually, it's got me kind of wondering are there other My Vegas experiments that you guys really want to try? But until next time, Spinners and Sharks, this is Ace of Vegas signing out, wishing you all strong hands, and of course, happy spinning, you guys. Viva, Ace of Vegas. Viva, Ace of Vegas. Viva, Ace of Vegas. Viva.